all about Africa for kids. Africa is the second largest continent on the planet. The African continent is also one of the most culturally, ecologically, and geographically diverse of all seven continents. Today, we're going to learn some interesting facts about this amazing place. Africa is sometimes called the Mother Continent or the Cradle of Mankind because it's the oldest inhabited continent on the Earth. This means that humans, who scientists call Homo sapiens, and their ancestors have lived on the African continent the longest. Do you want to guess how long? Would you believe over 5 million years? That's right, 5 million years! The African continent is the only place in the world where scientists have discovered fossils of humans and their ancestors through every stage of evolution. These ancestors include Australopithecines, our earliest ancestors, Homo habilis, our tool-making ancestors, and Homo erectus, an advanced relative to Homo habilis that was able to walk upright. Today, Africa spans a huge geographical area of about 12 million square miles, divided into 54 countries, the most countries of any continent on the planet. It's home to over 3,000 indigenous peoples, over 1,000 languages, and has a total population of about 1.1 billion people. That's roughly 15% of the entire population of the Earth. The continent is surrounded almost entirely by water. The Mediterranean Sea, the Red Sea, the Indian Ocean, and the Atlantic Ocean. It's divided in half almost equally by the equator and also includes the islands of Cape Verde, Madagascar, Mauritius, Seychelles, and Comoros. The terrain across the continent includes large mountains, tropical rainforests, grassy savannas, and deserts. Here's a fun fact. On the easternmost part of the African mainland is a peninsula often referred to as the Horn of Africa. It got this name because the land formation looks a lot like a horn. Just by looking at this map, what country do you think is the largest? If you said Algeria, you're right. Even though Algeria is the largest country by area, the country of Nigeria is the most populated, with 185 million people. The smallest country is Seychelles which is a nation of 115 mostly uninhabited islands in the Indian Ocean directly east of the African continent. Other African countries include Ethiopia, with the second highest population on the continent, Egypt, which acts as a land bridge between Africa and Southwest Asia, and is the size of the countries of France and Germany combined. And Kenya, which is home to the city of Nairobi, the safari capital of the world. Africa is also home to one of the longest rivers in the world, the Nile, which is over 4,000 miles long. It runs south to north, starting at Lake Victoria, which is one of the largest freshwater lakes in the world, and ending at the Mediterranean Sea. Other cool geographical features include the Sahara Desert, which is the largest hot desert in the world, and Mount Kilimanjaro, which is the highest point on the continent, and the tallest volcano in the Eastern Hemisphere. Because the African continent is so large and its land is so diverse, there are lots of exciting attractions 
that bring tourists from all over the world to African countries. One of the most famous tourist attractions in northern Africa is probably the pyramids at Giza, near Cairo, Egypt. These pyramids were built by the ancient Egyptians around 2650 BC from over 2.5 million blocks of limestone. Can you imagine building such huge structures by hand and having them last so long? It's a pretty cool piece of history. At Volcanoes National Park in the Rwandan rainforest, you can see mountain gorillas or golden monkeys in the wild. If you happen to like waterfalls, Victoria Falls on the border of Zambia and Zimbabwe would be amazing to visit. It's over twice the height and width of Niagara Falls in North America and is considered one of the seven natural wonders of the world. Africa is also home to many animals like lions, giraffes, zebras, and elephants, to name a few. In fact, every year there's a great migration or movement of animals traveling from Tanzania to Kenya in January and then from Kenya back to Tanzania in September. Here's an interesting fact. Which animal do you think is more likely to attack humans? Lions, crocodiles, or hippopotamus? If you said hippopotamus, you're right. More humans are injured or killed by hippos than any other animal in Africa. Who would have thought that hippos were so aggressive? Now that we've learned a little bit about the continent of Africa, let's review. True or false, Africa is the largest continent in the world. False, it's the second largest. Fill in the blank. The blank river is one of the longest rivers in the world. Did you say Nile River? That's right. Which country is the biggest by area in Africa? Which is the smallest? The biggest is Algeria, and the smallest is Seychelles. Great job, everybody! The next time you look at a tall mountain or a river, you can think of Mount Kilimanjaro or the Nile River. If you're taking a trip to the zoo, you can visit some of the animals who are native to the African continent. And maybe one day, you can even visit this continent in real life. Hope you had fun learning with us. Visit us at learnbright.org for thousands of free resources and turnkey solutions for teachers and homeschoolers.